Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna walk you through the steps on how you go about setting up automatic investing or recurring investing in an E-Trade account. And I'm not talking about automatically reinvesting dividends or interest. What I'm talking about is maybe every couple of weeks or maybe every month, you put a certain amount of money into your E-Trade account and you don't want it sitting in cash when it's transferred. You just want it automatically invested into something like a mutual fund. So I'm gonna show you how you can do that. It's relatively simple. So head on over to eTrade.com. I'll link their webpage right at the top of the video description if you wanna access it through those means. And then go ahead and sign into your E-Trade account with your user ID, password, and then click log in. And once you're logged in to your E-Trade account, on your account page, go over and hover over where it says trading here towards the top, and then go down and click on where it says automatic investing. And then that takes us over to the automatic investing starter page here where it says put your investing on autopilot investing small amounts now can make a big difference over time with automatic investing you can set up recurring investments in no transaction fee mutual funds starting with just 25 bucks so what we want to do at this point is click get started and it's going to be a four-step process here where you're going to select your account then select a fund to automatically invest in then enter some details and then finally doing a review and you're going to select an account that's in your e-trade and a lot of people are probably just going to do this with their retirement account such as a roth ira for instance so let's go ahead and check the box here on a retirement account and then click continue and you can either look up a symbol or a fund name in this area with the little magnifying glass, or if you already have a mutual fund that you're invested in, in that particular account that you selected, it should show up as eligible funds that you own. And in my retirement account, the only mutual fund that I'm invested in is the Vanguard Target Retirement for 2050. So let's say that's the fund that I wanna automatically invest in. So I click a little check box right next to the ticker symbol and then click continue. And then when we get to the enter details page, Oftentimes, especially if it's the first time you're investing in a mutual fund, you'll have an initial amount that you need to invest to get into that mutual fund. But if you already have reached that amount with the fund that you selected, then this particular amount will be waived. And then after you decide on your initial amount, you can enter in a recurring amount. And let's say you're investing in a Roth IRA, which has for most of you guys, it's gonna be maxed out at $6,000 in contributions a year that you can take advantage of. That comes out to about 500 bucks a month. So let's just say that's what you wanted to set up in this instance, $500 monthly into that target retirement mutual fund. And then you can select whether it's every week, twice a month, every month, so on and so forth. This is just gonna be an every month situation. And then you have to choose where you'd like the funding for this plan to come from, whether it's one of your other E-Trade accounts or an external funding source, such as a bank account that you have hooked into your E-Trade account. So select that and then click continue. And then the last page here is just simply reviewing what you wanna set up with the fund name, the initial amount, the recurring amount, and then the plan details. This one is going to be monthly. It's gonna give you the investment date and what you're gonna do with dividends, for instance. And oftentimes people are just gonna be reinvesting in the same fund when they get those dividends. You can see the funding details, what funding account you're coming from and the investment account that it's going towards. And if everything checks out, just go ahead and click where it says complete order. And then you should have automatic investing or recurring investing set up in your E-Trade account with all the specifications that you've entered in. So I hope this video was helpful. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Consider subscribing and I'll catch you back here next time.